Welcome to this CTSNet guest editor series. My name is Joel Dunning, and I'm delighted to welcome you to this robotics series. Uh, we've got a great set of videos that have been put together by our special editor, who is, I'm pleased to say, David Rice, who is from the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer uh, care center. He's done a great job of this. He's a very experienced robotic surgeon. He's run a load of conferences in robotic surgery. So I'd like to welcome you. Thank you very much, David, for putting this all together. Well, thank, thanks, Joel. And, uh, you know, I mean, I think you actually deserve the credit for putting together all of this. Uh, uh, this is a great idea to, to uh, collate all of these videos together. Uh, and, and really, uh, I think my involvement has been very limited, apart from making a video and, and uh, um, you know, suggesting uh, others to do so as well. But uh, I think you've put together an absolutely fantastic um, a series of videos that really speak, I think, to the benefit of robotic surgery. Robotics obviously gets a, a bit of a hard rap, I think, uh, because it clearly is more expensive nowadays. Uh, and it's very hard, I think, to sort of show value. But to me, as somebody who's been doing robotic surgery now for almost six, seven years, um, you know, the value, I think, of the procedure comes in, in these more complex cases. And this is, this is what we've aimed to try and, and show uh, with, with the videos presented. So you've got eight videos in this series and they're really high quality. We've got Bob Sofolio, we've got Bernie Park, uh, we've got Frank Amalfi, uh, we've got Lazaro Herrera, we've got people from all over the world, we've got the, the world leaders actually narrating these. So which ones really stood out for you? Which did you learn from? Because I learned so much. Well, I mean, there's 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 really so much that you can pick up and, 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 and I, I really enjoyed watching every single one of them. I would say um, you know, the, the, some of the pearls uh, that, that, that I picked up were when we're doing a sleeve resection, for instance, to use the, the locking uh, V-lock suture or a suture that, that automatically uh, applies the, 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 the tension. Um, very, very helpful. Some of the uh, dissection of, of uh, Bernie Park's uh, anterior basilar segmentectomy, I mean, the, the the fine detail that you can get out onto the lung with the uh, with the robot, I think, is you know really really terrific. But I mean, all of the all of the videos, I I, I must say, I learned uh, I learned a little bit. I've never done a, a pneumonectomy, for instance, uh, so it was fantastic to see Mark Delusky, uh, again, one of the pioneers of the uh, of the technology, to to uh, demonstrate how that's done. Yeah, and, and it's really great to see that actually you can see all the little nuances of slightly different approaches. Everybody's done a great job of doing outside views of showing their exact port placement. They're a little bit different. Frank and is a bit higher than some. A few of the uh, assistant ports are in different places. Uh, and then Bernie Park did a great job of showing the laser pairing up that, uh, that the XI can do. So, yeah, there are so many different tips and hints, aren't there, that you can see. I think that's true, and and really, you know, that's that's surgical education, isn't it? I mean, you 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 don't get just trained by one person. You you get to see a lot of different techniques, and you choose and pick what works for you. And and clearly, these videos demonstrate, if nothing else, that there's a lot of different ways to skin this cat. Um, so not uh, not just one right way. Yeah, well, it's certainly a very exciting time to be a robotic thoracic surgeon. I hope uh, everybody learns a little something from this. So for myself, Joel Dunning, uh, and everyone at CTSNet, thank you very much, David Rice, for putting this together. Uh, and I'm sure we'll leave yours to be the highlight at the very end. <laughs> I doubt that. But Joel, thank you so much for allowing me the opportunity to, uh, to, to, to be this guest editor. And I think you've really uh, you, you, you're putting together a fantastic series here.